Hey guys, what's up? It's Kinsey and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a what's in my bags video. If you guys are new here and you guys like this video, I would love if you guys could stick around by subscribing. Also, if you guys want to see me style these bags, as always, follow my Instagram. That is where I post more styling kind of stuff. But anyways, I recently picked up two bags from Marc Jacobs. I have honestly, I saw these probably Christmas break and I think I had like already just bought a bag or something. I don't know. There was a reason that I didn't buy them, but I was like in love with them. I've always liked Marc Jacobs, but right now their stuff is really, really cool. It's just kind of like weird and different, just fun. I've been a big fan. It also honestly looks a lot like I know that Marc Jacobs is nice, but it looks even nicer than Marc Jacobs. Like, it looks even more, like, upscale in my opinion, at least. So, I'll, first, I will show you both of the bags. I go between these two bags pretty much every day. So, um, like, it's like a what's in my bag, but, you know, whatever. Um, so the first bag that I have, this one, let me see. It is the Marc Jacobs Little Big Shot. This bag was $370. You guys will see the close-ups and stuff, but it's a really nice size. It's really amazing quality, and it's, like, super weird and just, like, different colors and stuff. Guys, I really am branching out. Look at me with all the color. It's crazy. But I love this bag. It's perfect as, like, an everyday bag, especially for when I'm vlogging because I need a bigger um, bag sometimes. But this one actually also fits my vlog camera. It just doesn't fit the tripod. But, I have, ooh, I have this bag, which is the... Snapshot bag and this one was 295 like just under 300 this one is smaller if you guys happen to care about having a camera in your bag It does fit a camera. Um, I Love the strap on this one like this one is what really like this is what sold the bag to me Which I can you can buy the bag separately. I actually just saw that you can get a leopard print strap so I definitely want to get the leopard one for this bag and also What's cool is like in the fall, this small bag with this strap is gonna be so cool. So I feel like you just get so much more for your money. Like you can switch them up and they look like completely different bags. I definitely wanna get the leopard strap um, for this bag. But anyways, this strap is so cool. It says Marc Jacobs all over. Like I was just completely obsessed with this. It's such a small, effortless bag. They have colors that are more neutral if you guys are into that. I was just really trying to be, trying to be funky, you know? So as far as, uh, they come in dust bags, I don't have them. I've never done a bag video before like this. Um, what else do you guys want to know? I'll have them linked down below, and I'll also link down below a few straps and a few of the other color options that I really like. But yeah, they're just like super fun. They are obviously like pricier for a bag, but as far as like if you get like a high-end designer bag, they're very inexpensive in comparison to those. With that being said, I know that $370 is a lot of money. I'm not saying that it isn't. I just mean in comparison to like Gucci or something, you know? So I literally love this bag so much. It is amazing. And I also love this one. I'm so glad that I got them. Okay. So, I more recently used this bag, which I switched between these two bags literally like multiple times a day. So, I'm going to start off with my what's in my bag. Um, so, again, for this one, this one's probably my favorite, but I also love that one. Moving on, no, no one cares. The first thing that I have is my disposable camera. I am also filming a video on how I do the whole disposable camera. People ask me on Instagram all the time what filter I use. I actually have a disposable camera, but I'm also going to show you guys how to get the effects with just an iPhone like editing and stuff. So I have a disposable. I pretty much always have one in my bag. I have my card case. I really, really need to replace this card case. It is worn and worn. I've had this card case for like two years now and I just love card cases. I will never go back to wallets ever. I actually should get the one from this line because I love those. But um, yeah, I just have my card case. Big card case girl over here. Um, apparently I have some sunglasses. I have these that are so torn up, like they are just damaged and ruined beyond belief. I need to get new ones. Like, do you guys see? It's not a cute look. Um, these were, I think, the whatever Desi Perkins, I forget the name of them. They're really popular. Comment down below if you guys know what I'm talking about, but love, love Desi. Have some Apple headphones. This is also so exciting, guys. Why do people like these videos? I don't know. I have my keys for my car. I have, what is this? Oh, that's cute. Went to a Dodgers game the other night and they gave us the 60th anniversary collector card set. So I have those in there. I have a receipt, what is this from? Oh, from the Dodgers game, okay. 
I have my vlog camera, which if you guys don't watch my vlogs, you absolutely should. My vlogs are much better than my normal sit down videos, I feel. Um, but I just love my vlogs. Wow, I have another one of these. This is really crazy. It's something else. Oh my gosh, I have another pair of sunglasses. Who freaking knew? Wow. Yeah, so, oh, and I have a hair tie, and I have, oh, 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 ho, ho. Of course, I have my lip balm. I will never leave my house without this. The Bite Beauty Agave Lip Mask. This stuff is amazing. I also have a lip pencil that needs to be sharpened and until further notice is of no use to me. So, that's what I have. I normally have my phone in there as well, but it's on the charger because, of course, it's always dead. Okay, so for the next bag, again, I really just throw things in back and forth, so I don't even know what would be in here. Okay, so there's two openings with this bag, which is cool. Um, I don't really know why I think that's cool. What are the benefits to that? Just keeping things separate? I don't know. Organized? So I have some cash, which I literally never have cash. Comment down below if you guys have cash. Like, when you go places and they need cash, I'm like, well, it's not the 1800s anymore. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But, like, seriously, I never have cash. And then I have two lip products, of course. This one is Stone Fox ColourPop. I love this line of lipsticks. I don't even know what it is, but it's the stars, and they have, like, stars printed around them. I'm a big fan, I have to say. The Glossier Lip Gloss, I need to replace this. This lip gloss is amazing. I think a lot, not a lot, but some of the Glossier products, in my opinion, are overhyped. But this is not overhyped. This stuff is amazing. I think really just I don't like the serums that much. Everything else I really like. But um, I could, if I wanted to, like I can fit my camera in here. Yeah, like I can definitely fit the camera in here. I can fit my phone. I can fit my keys. This one is just like a lot more snug, obviously. It's smaller. But it's still really cute for like day to day, so. If any of you guys decide to pick up these bags and we become twins, soul sisters even, let me know in the comments down below. I don't know if this video was helpful or useful to any of you guys, but I am a big fan of the bags. I think that they are both amazing and I wanted to show you guys what I keep in them. It's nothing too crazy, but yeah, I haven't done a video like this in forever, so I thought I might as well bring it back to the old days. I love you guys so much. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you soon. Subscribe if you guys haven't already. Okay, bye.